Hello, hello to all my beautiful pals. You are watching Holly or Kawaii Unicorn on Roblox if you would like to follow me and it would be real nice if you did. Today is super exciting because I am at the airport for the first time in a million years because if you know what, I'm not gonna say what it is. I'm finally going on vacation. I don't even know where I'm going. It doesn't even matter. I'm just so excited. All right, fading to black. Looks like it's time to board the airplane. Whoa, no way, this is a totally empty flight. I'm gonna get like three seats to myself and I'll be able to lay down across the entire seat and I'll be able to sleep the entire time. I really hope that these armrests will actually go up. Oh my gosh, there's there's literally no one else on this plane. Should I be worried about that? Hopefully we have, hopefully we've got a crew. Hello, anyone in here? Anyone here to make my snackies? My delicious airplane meals? I'm not even joking, I love airplane food. It's so much fun. Okay, the captain says, hello everyone. This is your captain speaking. Okay, thank goodness we have a captain. Welcome aboard flight 8851. Whoa, so is this everyone? Oh my gosh, I have a private plane. The captain says, we're currently flying at an altitude of 33,000 feet above sea level. The weather looks good, which means we will be arriving in no time to our destination. Wow, I don't even know where our destination is. Oh my gosh, comment right now your dream destination. Where you hope I'm going? Maybe I'm going to India. Maybe I'm going to New Zealand. The captain says, feel free to explore the airplane, which I will be doing using the uh, star code unicorn if I need to purchase any Robux, hint, hint. I mean, the airplane looks great. I'm loving exploring it. Oh my gosh, this must be like business class. Yeah, that's probably business class or like first class or something like that. And then I assume this is where the crew hangs out. Well, well I've got a pair of scissors. That seems ominous. Okay. I'm making a, making a mental note. Okay, the captain says, now please find your seat as we are about to cross an area of high turbulence. I like how he's talking like there's like an airplane full of people when really it's just me and my unicorn backpack just like marching all over the place. <laughs> but I mean, it probably is pretty good advice. So let me look at my ticket here. Um, okay, so it looks like I am in seat in row number 17. Oh no, turbulence. Oh no, okay, I gotta get to my seat. Um, okay, I'm stuck in the ground. Uh, row number 17, where is... Where is row number 17? Or is it seat number 17? Um, okay, captain says, thank you for your cooperation. That's very optimistic of you. Um, you know what? Maybe I'll just, should I just sit here? No, okay, there's gotta be a row 17 here somewhere. Why have I got a ticket? Why have I got a ticket that doesn't have, okay. Get ready as our crew prepares a snack for everyone. Just what I was waiting for. Um, this is my favorite part of the flight. Um, are they gonna know to bring me the right snacky? If I'm in, if I'm in the wrong seat? All right, the crew says, hello everyone, we are the crew members. We will be delivering delicious sandwiches. Oh my gosh, there's finally someone else here and they've got delicious sandwiches. I'm ready to enjoy. Excuse me, where are you going? Sorry, I'm like the only one here. So maybe I'll take all six sandwiches. I know I have a non-existent seat. It's kind of a problem. Hello, any chance you have a delicious vegan sandwich for row 17? Oh, I'm about to say something. I'm saying ellipsis. Oh, I'm saying a pause. Oh no. I'm, I'm not feeling very well. Is it the turbulence? Is it? Oh, wait. The sandwich has mayo? I'm allergic to mayo. Oh my gosh, do I have my EpiPen? Ooh, ah! Is there a doctor on board? The crew's like, oh no, quickly. We need to find Kawaii Unicorn's baggage for medicine. Yeah, that's right. I, I always make sure that I carry my medicine. Look in the baggage stores above you. I don't remember even putting my bag up there, but okay, let's just let's just have a look. Maybe some of the, maybe one of the helpful crew members put it up there for me and I didn't even notice. Okay, checking all. Wow, there is no luggage on this entire flight. Oh no, I'm having an allergic reaction to mayo. This is not good. How am I supposed to get to my dream destination if I'm having an allergic reaction and my throat is closing up? This is not part of the itinerary. Any of the crew want to help me with this? Because I feel like I've searched pretty much everywhere. Oh my gosh, what is that countdown? Is that the countdown until I... Oh, no, 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 no. I found it. I found it. I found it. Okay. That's my bag. I found it. Get it down here. I need that EpiPen. All right. Phew. That was a close one. Yeah, no kidding. There was literally a countdown clock to when it was just too late for me. I'd be a goner, a goner from a mayo sandwich. All right, the captain is uh, coming back online here. Uh, they say, good afternoon to all passengers. I inform you that we've reached a stable altitude. That would be a good time to sit back, take a nap and enjoy the ride. Oh my gosh, I haven't even checked out the in-flight entertainment. Maybe we've got some amazing movies. Okay, I guess that's me falling asleep. <laughs> it's time for my nap. 
Ooh, look at me. I'm in business class. This is so fancy. Wow. Um, I wonder what kind of special treaties I'm going to get up here. The captain is um, saying, good night, passengers. Remember to stretch your legs. We still have a few hours to go. That's actually really good advice. You know, you want to you wanna get up when you're on the airplane. You want to move those leggies around, get that blood flowing, get it pumping around. Um, cool. All right. A few hours till our destination. I can't wait to find out where we're going. I can't wait to read the comment section and be able to see where your dream destinations are. Um, uh-oh. It appears we've lost energy? Oh, hang on as we try to fix it. Okay, so all the lights are off. Are we still flying? Uh-oh. Guys, look! What is that on the right wing? I don't know what- Oh, whoa. What was that, an alien? Um, okay. The arrival of a red-eyed alien. Things just got weird. No. Well, not survive. Um, are those snakes? What do you mean? What do you mean, other snakes? Oh my gosh, there's snakes! On, there's snakes on the plane! Why would you do this to me, alien? There's snakes chasing me. Okay, what exactly am I supposed to do? There's no one else here. Where's the crew? Oh my gosh, I died. Okay, so the alien was right, but they didn't know that I can uh, just buy myself another light. So guess what, aliens? I am back. Oh no, I'm still being chased by snakes. How exactly am I supposed to escape? Where did that trolley go with all the sandwiches on it? Maybe I can stand on the trolley because snakes are naturally afraid of sandwiches. Okay, guys, there's an open restroom. Quickly, we'll be safer in there. Yeah, if I can lock out the snakes, um, unless the snakes, can the snakes, can the snakes use locks? Do they have fingers? They might be evolving. Um, okay, uh, where's this bathroom? I like, there's like almost 10 seconds left and I don't know what happens at the end of that. Oh my gosh, no, 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 no. <gasps> Okay, I made it inside, and this bathroom is enormous. Like seriously, if I ever saw an, air pl an airplane bathroom this big, I would um, not know what to do with myself. Okay, I think I'm safe in here. I think I'm safe from the snakes. Okay, that was scary. We should discuss what the heck is happening. Who do I think I'm gonna discuss this with? Because as previously noted, I appear to be the only passenger on this flight. It's like there were loads of people in the airport, and there's like a captain, we've got a crew, we've got a scary alien, um, but no other passengers for me to discuss, discuss this with, which I guess is why there's no more dialogue. <laughs> I'm cool though, like this is a vast improvement from previously when I was having an allergic reaction and then I was getting chased by deadly snakes. Um, so, you know, things are looking up for me on this holiday. Not super relaxing so far. Okay, we're back in the airplane and it looks like the snakes have disappeared. Maybe somebody um, threw them out the emergency exit. And also the power is back up, which is amazing news. Um, just want another snacky. Oh, and the snakes are gone. Thank God. Yeah, that was really intense. Um, oh yeah, can't forget about the alien. The creature on the wing is also gone. Creepy. I mean, it is a bit creepy, but I'm pretty happy that they're gone. Don't love creepy aliens standing on the wing of the plane. Uh, oh no, the captain's like, your attention passengers, I have good news and bad news. What do we want first? Ooh, okay, we're getting the good news first. So the good news is the power is back up. What's the bad news? Is it about the aliens? They're totally coming, aren't they? I've just got this feeling, got this feeling that they are coming for me. Okay, so the bad news is that we are losing a significant amount of oxygen. Oxygen mask will drop from over your seas. Take one quick. Oh my gosh. Okay, um, make sure to adjust your own mask before helping others. I'm already wearing a mask. <laughs> Wait a second. Why didn't that mask go on? Okay, let's. I'm gonna pull it down towards me to start the flow of oxygen. Where's the flow of oxygen? Am I? Can I breathe right now? Am I, am I suffocating? Okay, uh, this mask will keep you safe until we stabilize the oxygen levels. That's cool, but like, did I, did I get a mask? Oh no, maybe, oh no, no, no. Oh, I'm wearing it over top of my other mask. Okay, just kidding. We're totally fine. Oh, what's happening? Um, I hope the aliens aren't back. Okay, look for, look for a set of red eyes. Um, <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Oh my god! What is this? That was also my question. Me and my little avatar here, we're on the same page. It looks like a bomb. Oh no! Oh no! What are we going to do? All right, well, it appears that we're in like an action movie. Okay, everyone, calm down. Who am I talking to? Unfortunately, this might be evidence that I have suffered oxygen deprivation because I'm talking to myself. Okay, if we find something sharp to cut the cables, we might be able to save Kuwait Unicorn. Let's go! I'm 
fully talking to myself. I'm having like multiple conversations with myself. Oh, I found the pair of scissors. Oh, thank goodness they are literally the only usable item on this plane. All right, which cable should I cut? What are our options here? Oh, do either of them say cut to disable bomb? I went with red because, you know, it's a pretty nice color. Also seems like a dangerous color. Uh-oh, what's happening? Did I? Oh my gosh, it disappeared. Wow, we did it. Congratulations, everyone. I didn't think that we were gonna make it, uh, but apparently we did. Or otherwise, this is all just like an oxygen deprivation hallucination, um, or who really knows? Something's happening. This has been a comedy of errors so far. Um, hopefully those aliens don't come back. I mean, do you do you think they're aliens? Let me know in the comment section um, what you think they are. Ooh, I just noticed something. We haven't heard from the crew in a while. We should look for them and check and see if everything's okay. Yeah, this seems like it's not gonna go well. I mean, maybe maybe the crew's having a lunch break. I mean, they disappeared with all of those delicious sandwiches that were just full of mayo. Um, so hopefully they're having a nice little tea party in the crew room. Um, they, deserve a, they deserve a break. Um, if I were the crew, where would I be? Maybe I can call someone? Nope. Could the crew be in these lockers? Oh, oh, I found them. Um, you guys okay? They're unconscious. We need to alert the captain. Okay, good idea. Let's alert the captain. Quickly, get to the captain's room. What if the captain's also unconscious? What do we do if the captain is no longer flying in the plane? Does anyone here know how to fly a plane? I'm the only one here. Okay, let's, let's check in with the captain. Um, oh no, it's locked. Is there a key? We need to find a key. Or, or maybe there's a, maybe there's a keypad. Something is happening inside. Captain might be in trouble. Okay, bust that door down. Let's see a nice big kick. This door needs a code. If we find it, we might be able to open it. Hurry up. Okay, if I were a code, where would I be? Maybe in a cupboard? Maybe, maybe in the, in the pocket of one of the crew? Um, or in... Uh, the business class area, in the restroom. Okay, I really do not know where, like, would anyone even write down the door code? I'm not convinced. Um, if only these crew members weren't unconscious. I'd be able to ask them. Hmm, that number there might be the code. I mean, it would be a little bit weird to just write the code on the, on like the side of a cupboard, but okay, I think it was 5722. Let's, let's see if we can get it. All right, let's see if this works. Come on, this has got to work. How do I put in the code? <laughs> Hello? Hello? Trying to put in the code. Is there a keypad? Come on, pop up keypad. Oh no, this is not going well. Um, don't really know what to do next. I could, I could check on the crew. Maybe I could like um, do like a wellness check. I could be like, hello, hello, can you hear me? And then like pinch them, give them some little pinchies. Be like, hello, hello, can you hear me? Yeah, see, look, it's 5722. Oh, I just had to click on it. I found the code. Cool. I guess we're going in. Is that it? Okay, let's find out what's happening in in the cockpit. Uh, oh, oh no, I still need to. Oh no, it's you. Not you again. Um, it's the creature. Um, that thing's so scary. I don't like it at all. <gasps> you will pay for what you've done. <gasps> I think I ate, I think I ate their sandwich. You think you are here on accident, but you're not. Huh, okay. I mean, I thought I was here, I thought I was here for a holiday. Oh, I brought you here, all of you. This creature also doesn't realize that I'm the only one on the plane? That is not possible. I have free will, and I decided to go on this vacation with a mystery destination. The, the creature's like, it is, and now it's time <gasps> to die. Uh, okay, so that actually, again, not part of the itinerary, not part of my plan for the holiday. Um, I'm just gonna not die. See you in the afterlife. Wow, okay, that alien creature thing is like spontaneously combusting, which is pretty cool, but oh my gosh, the captain, <gasps> the captain's also unconscious. Oh no, no one's driving the plane. The captain is unconscious. Yeah, we're gonna have to figure out a plane and quick. I mean, look at that screen. It says danger. The plane is falling. We're falling right out of the sky. What are we gonna do? Um, I think we're gonna try to fly the plane. 
um, which is probably gonna be difficult because all of these buttons look exactly the same. We need to find the autopilot button. We need to find it or we're gonna crash. Oh, this is the worst flight ever. Click everything and find that button before we die. Um, that's really um, a weird strategy, but I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna click every single button and I'm sure that all of them are gonna be totally fine. Um, nothing here that's gonna make us crash even faster. Okay, gotta click all these buttons. Click, 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 click every button. Oh my gosh, there's so many buttons. Who made this many buttons in the plane? It's like, why would you not label it autopilot? This is like, if you have a label maker, this would be like job number one. Um, okay, we're doing a good job though. We got 30 seconds left to, to crush all these buttons. And let me tell you something, I am really good at pressing buttons. Uh, okay, okay, there's just a few more to go. Of course it's gonna be like the last one. Oh no, there's even more on this side. Okay, I found the button with 16 seconds to spare. You are welcome, everyone. You're welcome, captain, the crew, you're welcome. Okay, we did it. We saved the plane. Wow, danger over, I hope, unless those creatures come back. It has been a very crazy flight. I just want to be home already. I thought we were going on vacation. I thought we were going to a mystery destination. Um, I mean, home actually sounds pretty good right now. I mean, let's, let's cover what's happened so far. So I've had an allergic reaction to a sandwich full of mayo. I've been shaked by snakes. There was a bomb. There's like this creepy creature who has been like really bugging me. Okay, so now all we need to do is find the emergency phone so we can call for help. Well, great news, I've already seen the emergency phone and it is at the back of the plane. Um, and then I should probably help those unconscious people. Um, maybe, maybe they need a sandwich. Okay, let's, let's use this emergency phone. Got an emergency call to make. Hello? Um, you're not gonna believe this. Some weird stuff has been happening. Hello? We need help. Our captain is unconscious. Right, he's still unconscious. We've got auto flight, auto, auto flight going. Um, okay, but it's not gonna be enough. The airport crew's like, don't worry, we'll get you home in no time. Is everyone okay? Yes, we are okay. Autopilot mode is on. Um, we're so not okay. Like, everyone is unconscious. Why did I say that? I mean, I know it's nice to be positive, but like we also need to communicate the seriousness of the situation. Okay, we've traced your location and we are taking control. Dope, didn't know that that was an option. Really happy about that. There's one last task I have for you. Someone needs to keep the plane on track. Oh my gosh, is it me? It's gonna be me. Find someone to sit on the co-pilot seat aside the captain. Right, okay, so kind of awkward. I'm the only one here, so it's gotta be me. Here we go to save the plane. I have to do everything on this flight. <laughs> Next, they're gonna want me to like hand out tea and coffee, maybe some drinks. Um, all right, I'm in the co-pilot seat. What's next? We're gonna be fine. All I have to do is keep this plane on track. I can do that, right? I mean, I've never flown a plane in my entire life, so probably it'll be fine. Okay, everyone, I got this. <laughs> oh my gosh. Love the confidence. Um, don't want anyone to panic. I'm also talking to, um, oh, it's you. Okay, this is actually not a good time. Oh no, it is Beck. Um, I'm kind of busy. I'm being a co-pilot for the first time in my life. I don't have time to be dealing with scary creatures. How are you still alive, Kawaii Unicorn? Whoa, okay, I mean, I killed a lot of your friends. Really? Is that why no one else is here? Did you? killed by imaginary friends, but you, there is something about you. Oh, is it my hair? Your energy does not let me kill you. I don't know what kind of voice I'm trying to do there. It actually sounds really horrible. Um, I'm not going anywhere with you, you monster. I'm the chosen one. I'm the chosen one. <laughs> what? I will come back for you. Oh my gosh, like literally, don't even bother. I am, I'm not going anywhere with you. Wow, okay, I'm like, I can't believe I was the only survivor. Um, yeah, that's really, wait, what is it? Wait, <gasps> that's it. Is that really it? Victory? Well, that was unexpected. 